Hi guys, so last week it was my 22nd birthday and it was probably one of the best birthdays that I've like ever had and um, it was just really really nice so I just wanted to say thank you to all my close friends that came out for a meal with me and thank you to everyone that sent me nice birthday messages on Instagram and stuff like that because it was really nice. So yeah, I just felt really loved I suppose because to me there's meant to be like five main things that show love and each person kind of leans more towards certain ones. Obviously the main one for most people is spending time with the person that you love but also giving gifts in my opinion because it could literally just be a drawing. I think the little things in most people's opinions like drawing or writing a song for someone or any of that kind of stuff is probably the nicest thing. So I'm going to start off with the stuff that my mum got me. A lot of it's already been kind of put around the house so I won't be able to show all of it. But um, first thing is she got me this Batman money box. I'm going to show you that. Check him out. So yeah, you've got to put money in the back of uh, Batman's neck. And um, it's because I keep my coins and then like um, keep it and you can put it into like a machine at Tesco and it gives you like a voucher back so you can spend money in Tesco and obviously everyone's going to be able to spend money in Tesco because it sells food and drink and clothes and DVDs and all the rest of it. She got me the Hobbit trilogy. I don't think it's as good as Lord of the Rings but it is good. I really love the elf girl. Oh, I think her name's Tauriel. Tar oh, all these names are so confusing. And the dragon school as well obviously so Hobbit. She got me a selfie stick and with the selfie stick she got me some headphones and like a phone case and a USB cable to go with it. It's just like a plain black um, kind of bendy rubber phone case. Recently I bought myself a new perfume and I've been wearing Chanel number no. 5 and it's like such a nice smell. And she got me the soap to go with it. She got me the soap to go with it and she got me a little orange box to put the soap in because it's just for me. Look at the size of this soap. That is a big soap. She got me these, um, this Ted Baker like lip balm set. This is what it looks like, how cool is that? And the flavours I think are blackberry, berry and vanilla. She got me these, they were in like, they were in like a nice box obviously when she first got me but I've opened them since then. These are all like hand moisturisers. This one is shea butter, apparently it's 20% shea butter. And these ones, look at all the cute little pictures on the front of these. Yeah, check those out. I've literally just noticed, by the way, that I can change where the camera is focusing by clicking on it. I've only had this camera for about three years. <laughs> so there you go. Now I can focus on my face, or if I want to focus on these, I can click on it and do that. It's freaking amazing and click back on my face. I'm just learning all this stuff now, by the way. You're just going to have to um, put up with me learning things for a minute. So yeah, she got me this Primark bag that I showed off to her. Ah. Yeah, so that's what all of my things are in. And um, oh, she got me my very own yoga mat. Recently been to yoga with my friend Jade and then me and my mum went a couple of times as well. So she got me my own big purple yoga mat and a little thing you can carry it around on like this. She got me this dress from Boohoo. It's got nice long sleeves and a nice pattern and a nice long skirt on the bottom. So I wore this when I went to go see the Wicked musical while I was in London because I booked like a four day holiday for me and my boyfriend just to go down to London. We did like um, the London Dungeons and the Warner Brothers tour of like all the Harry Potter sets and stuff like that and my mum bought us tickets to the Wicked musical as part of my birth it was one of my birthday gifts as well because that was probably have been like the most expensive thing that she bought us and the Wicked musical was really good so I, I wore this and I did like my eyeshadow all dark and stuff so thank you very much mummy for all that stuff okay moving on to the stuff that my boyfriend got for me just sorting out my camera again <laughs> um uh -huh. that laugh was dead attractive my boyfriend got me a dress from ASOS. So this is like a baby doll dress. Um, I think it's baby doll style. It's got like little sleeves here. It's kind of see-through so I'm gonna have to wear, I keep lifting my arms up, I hope I've shaved. Ugh. He got me these phone cases because this is my favourite band and this is my favourite animal. A lot of you guys probably know that already so he got me those. I nearly forgot to mention my mum got me a backpack. This was something that I actually asked her for because I really needed a new backpack. Well I didn't really really need one but I was getting a bit bored of my Batman one because I've got so many Batman things. I go out with a Batman backpack and like a Batman cap and a Batman phone case and I just look a bit crazy. So I wanted one 
<laughs> which I'll still look pretty crazy because I have everything with foxes on all the time as well. But this is a foxy backpack and it's got more like places to put things in and the inside is a light colour so you can actually find things in there. Do you know what I'm saying? And, and this is where you can put like books or an iPad or something like that. I currently have Attack of the Titan in there. Attack of the Titan. Attack on Titan. I always say that. So yeah, I've currently got that in there as, along with my lyric book. And there's like little places here that you can put like bottles of water or bottles of iced tea or whatever you want in. So yeah, I'm not sure where she got these from but it says Swanky Swans on it. So this is like the coolest thing ever. Thank you. So yeah, back onto what my boyfriend got for me. Um, these vans he actually gave me before my birthday and I've been wearing them like nearly every single day. I was really worried at first because he said, he mentioned like sequins and he said he had to find um, a vegan version because they're normally made with real leather I think. So these, uh, I'm not a vegan, I'm just a vegetarian but I try and avoid like leather and stuff like that. It's just like a personal choice kind of thing. So yeah, look how cute these are. These are like the shoes that I've been wearing nearly every day. And the last thing that my boyfriend got for me is this really cute photo frame and he's put some photos of us in there. I'm still trying to creep into the frame around here like, hello. And on the back, he's wrote a really nice poem for me. He'd probably be embarrassed if, not a poem. Poem? Lizzie, Lizzie did really well in English class. And yeah, he's, he's wrote something like, oh, you can get her on her tissue. <laughs> Yeah, he, um, he'd probably be embarrassed if I read out like what he'd wrote for me, but he's just basically saying that he loves me and stuff because that's what you should usually do. I love you, Connor. Thank you for the nice presents. How cute is my things that I got? Along with my little frozen balloon that my mum got for me. So, the meal that I had for my birthday, I just invited, um, I think it was like, well, my boyfriend and then my band members James and Dan and then Ollie Bomb and Jade and Adam which are two people that I used to work with so they're really nice you've probably seen them if you if you follow my Instagram or anything like that you'll probably know all about that meal already because I took like a million pictures with my new selfie stick and I'm just stood here with this and you're thinking what is that in her hands is she ever going to actually bring it up this is apparently a tea infuser so I'm not sure whether you put the tea in the bottom here or whether you put it in this part here so yeah, this is one of the things that Jade and Adam, I think, got me kind of together. So you put the tea either in the bottom or in this part and then it infuses and you've got like a really posh glass to drink your tea out of. So yeah, got a nice, a lot of bubble wrap to keep that in. So yeah, thank you Jade and Adam for that and they got me some English rose tea to go with it. We were all together like shopping around town after we'd had some cake and um, looking in like body shop and stuff like that. We was looking at the um, green tea new body body shop set and I bought myself that like a few days after it just a small one but she uh, she's got me like the full set and um, so yeah there's like a little shower gel in there and a scrubber and a body butter so yeah this is really it just smells so nice it's just really cool. And also a Barry M lipstick. This is like a green lipstick, but it comes off pink and it's just really cool and everyone was really impressed by it. I've seen it before, but like, um, where should I do it? I'll do it down here. So goes on, completely clear. And then I wonder how long it'll take. There you go. So you can see the pink and that's what it does on your lips, obviously. So if you rub it in as well, you can see like even more the way it like, but yeah, I think it's something to do with like the pH and balance in your skin and stuff like that. There's a few things like that coming out recently. So yeah, be careful touching this because it does stain. So yeah, those are really cool things I got from Jade and Adam. And Ollie got me this really cute gift bag with some like completely random stuff in it because we go out shopping like kind of a lot, but we just go in like the cheapest places possible and see things for like a pound of like, I need to get that. So this probably costs more than a pound, but I'm obviously not gonna like ask people how much they spent on me or anything like that because I'd probably feel bad. Um, but yeah, this is, I think it's a fox, but I said to her like, is this a fox or an owl? Like, we don't, we don't really know. But whatever it is, it's cute. I was using this while I was in London. So thank you for the bag, Ollie, it's really cool. 
and then these things she said she pretty much mainly got these from Poundland which is really cool I'm not sure if this is from Poundland but yeah these things are just random like really cute things that she got me she got me a frozen notepad so this is like really bendy I, I always keep notepads around because I like to write lyrics and stuff like that she got me an aerial pocket mirror she got me a big rubber phone case that looks like a bee me a frozen shower cap <laughs> a little Star Wars flannel and she got me this really cool ring which looks like a little foxy so yeah she got me this really cool foxy ring and um, it's really weird because like two days before she got me the ring not two days before she got me the ring earlier that day before she gave me this ring I bought myself another ring which looks really similar to this I'm not sure if it's around yeah, I, I need to clean my room so I can't see it. But I bought myself a ring that looks really similar to this and it was like she'd just read my mind or something. So yeah, that's really cool. And I think this was wrapped around one of the things that she'd like wrapped up or maybe she put it inside the bag for me. But it says, it's, it's a little foxy and it says, happy birthday Lizzie, love from Ollie. So how cool is that? My little foxy. I'm just going to quickly show you guys the cards that I got as well because some of them are really cute. Well, all of them are really cute. I don't know why I said some of them, but some of them have foxes on. So, um, This is a card I got from Helen and Justin. Oh, Helen and Justin. Helen and Justin are my godparents and they are like best friends with my, real, my biological parents. I don't know how to say that. You know what I mean? They're my godparents, so... If I, my, anything was to happen to my parents when I was younger, they would have been the people taking care of me and they're just really nice, cool people. And they always get me something really cool. And this year they got me Yankee Candle Natural Cotton, which is, I don't know whether my mum gave them tips or not, but um, I really like smells like this. It literally just smells like cleanness and like a bit perfumey. So yeah, I just love smells like that. My favorite smell, I'm smashing stuff up. Uh, my favorite smell is lavender. Um, I quite like floral. I'm not too into fruity things. My mum loves fruity smells. But yeah, so they got me this cute card. Thank you, Helen and Justin. This is off my sister, and my sister is like the bluntest person. <laughs> I think I know she's even more blunt than me. She wrote, "Have a lovely, have a lovely birthday. Gave you money as I didn't know what to get you, so you can buy it yourself." <laughs> yeah, my sister is really nice. She's got her husband's called Dave, and. Jackson and Ellie are uh, two children. So thank you to my big sister for that. This is off my uncle Darren. We always end up in conversations about like war and space and stuff like that whenever we go out for family meals. So this is, yeah, this is from my uncle Darren. And on the front, it says, counting the rings of a tree may seem absurd or even the spots on a ladybird. You can try counting sheep to help you slumber, but when it comes to age, it's merely a number. This is a really cute little kitty. This is the card that Jade got for me and it says happy birthday, have an awesome day, Jade, smiley face, kiss. Thank you Jade for the cute one. This one is off Adam because he always seems to find really cool cards. Like he bought, when, after we'd known each other for about a year I think, like at um, the place where we both work, he just randomly brought in a card with a fox on and was like, I saw this card and it's, it's a really cool card. So he got me a really cool card with a little foxy on it and it, it's got a little um, balloon. And it says, all the best, thanks for the laughs, and I hope your day is special from Adam. Kiss, kiss, kiss. So that's really cute. This is one I got from Ollie. This also has adorable little kitties on it. And um, it says, happy birthday, Lizzie, have a great day. Lots of love, Ollie. This is a little card off my boyfriend's grandparents, Ray and Sue. I'm, I'm like 90% sure that my boyfriend's mum got me a card as well, but yeah, I think it's up on my windowsill. I'm, I've been losing track of the cards because obviously my birthday was over a week ago now. So thank you to my boyfriend's family, really cool. This one is off my mum and dad. There's loads of words on this so I won't read it all out. And But they wrote, words can never say how much you amaze us and make us proud each day. Love you loads mum and dad. Got loads of kisses on it. How cool is that? And one off my granddad, Alan and grandma Kath loads of words in that one as well <laughs> so yeah uh, so many things this video is 25 minutes long now so I'm not gonna have loads of fun editing this so I'm just gonna quickly say bye I just wanted to say I wanted to say thank you very much to everyone for just being nice and making me just feel all special and loved and um, big hugs ah!
Thank you very much for watching. Click anywhere on my face to see more of my videos. I've been making a lot more vlogs recently, so some people who aren't into the vlogs, I know it might be confusing that my video, my channel is kind of half YouTuber, half musician, but they are like the two things that I think of myself as. So half of my videos are musical and half of them are kind of vlogs, so you might be not into half my videos, but I just wanted to say thank you very much for watching my channel and subscribing and stuff. So yeah, longest outro ever. Uh, yeah, I will see you all soon. Bye bye.